Year 5 Conventions. Today I'm going to model for you how to improve our ideas through word choice or jazzing up a sentence. I have a sentence that I've written on the board here. Now before we start, we need to look at the sentence and decide which are the nouns. And the two nouns that are in this one here are the word woman and the word garden. And they are nouns. So let's start with those. What other words could we think of for the word woman? And I'm thinking for woman, we could have a lady. She might be a lady. She might be a madam. She might be a queen. Or a princess. She might be a wife. Or a daughter. She might be a teacher. A grandmother. She could even be an auntie. Alright, we'll leave that. We're not going to change the other now, we'll just leave that one as it is. So, now we need to think of other words that can help us to spruce up our sentence. One of the other ones that is listed here is a verb. So, we'll start with a verb. What other verbs can we then have for the word walked? Well, she might amble, or because it's walked, we'll have to be ambled. She might float, so it would have to be floated. She might hike. She might march. Have strolled, or she might have sauntered. I have to check my spelling. Sauntered. Okay. Now these are the ones that are in the sentence, but we can add to this too. So what other things could we add to make this sentence even better? Well, we have nouns, so we could describe the noun. So, to do that, we need to use adjectives. So, for the nouns, we need adjectives. And adjectives help us to describe the noun. So, what, could, what sort of woman could she be? Well, she might be an old one. She might be a young one. She might be a beautiful one. She might be a stunning one. She might even be a Spanish one. She might be a fresh one. Now, not always do we just use one adjective, so we may even try to use two. And we'll come back to that a little bit later. So, because we've got two nouns, we also then need to look at adjectives for our garden. What type of garden is it? Well, it might be a floral garden with flowers in it. It could be a kitchen garden with herbs in it. It could be a cottage garden with all sorts of flowers and herbs all mixed together. 
It could be an overgrown garden that she hasn't seen for a while. So full of weeds and things. It could be a secret garden that nobody else knows about. It could be a picturesque garden which looks out over a place that she hasn't seen for a while. It could be a rose garden. It could even be a small garden. So we've got our things that describe our nouns. But we also need to have things, well we also have things that describe our verbs. And so things that describe our verbs are called adverbs because they add to the verbs. So what sort of things could we have there? This is then looking at how did she walk? So did she walk quickly? Or slowly? Did she walk delicately? Did she walk daintily? Or did she walk briskly? So now we have some adjectives, some adverbs, some other things for nouns, some other verbs. So now let's put them together. So what ones could we use to make our sentence and make it very much better than what it was before? Well, we don't want her just to be a woman. So let's see if we can use, make her a, a lady. Okay, so as a lady, what type of lady is her? Now, is she? Well, let's see if we can make her a young, beautiful Spanish lady. All right, so this young, Span young, beautiful Spanish lady, how is she getting to her garden? Let's say that she sauntered, which means that she just walked nice and slowly. And because she's walking slowly, we'll have to then look at one of these slowly words. Well, we've got three of the slowly words here that we could use. And let's say that she walked delicately. So she delicately, delicately sauntered to the... And now we need a type of garden. What type of garden may she have gone to? And because she's a Spanish woman and she's young, I think she might have secret garden but let's make it a little bit better than just a secret garden let's make it a picturesque secret garden so now we have a sentence that goes the beautiful young Spanish Lady Del Del Curriculum Delicately Sauntered to the Esque secret garden. Now, which do you like better, the first or the last? I think you'll find most people like the last.